So glaucoma can be subclassified in many different ways. Probably the most common subclassification is classifying glaucoma as open angle or closed or narrow angle. So then that asks the question, what's the angle? Well, the angle is where the fluid drains out of the eye. There's a clear watery fluid within the eye called aqueous that bathes the lens within the eye and the cornea, and it flows in at a rate of about 1% per minute, and therefore it has to flow out at that same rate. The place where it leaves the eye, where it exits the eye, is called the angle. The trabec trabecular meshwork is the tissue that the fluid drains through. And it's generally within the trabecular meshwork uh, that the problem uh, lies in glaucoma. The, the trabecular meshwork doesn't allow aqueous to pass through it rapidly enough. So it's produced at this rapid rate of about 1% per minute, but it can't get out at that same rate. So the fluid pressure within the eye builds up and damages the optic nerve. Most glaucoma in Caucasian, Northern European heritage is open angle, probably about 90%. In Asia, on the other hand, it's about 50-50. Narrow angle or closed angle is much more common in Asian descent for some reason. There's these ethnic variabilities. So in the US, uh, in the Caucasian, Northern European heritage, about 90% open angle. In Asian heritage, it's about 50-50. African American heritage is somewhere in between. Um, they're treated quite differently. Open angle glaucoma is generally treated with medicines or laser as the first step. If the angle is narrow, if the drainage system is very narrow, meaning the iris, the colored part of the eye, is too close to the drain, uh, we generally treat that with laser first. So it's very important to identify which glaucoma type you're talking about.